Hello and welcome to JXJ Aviation. In this video, we will be looking at what is flare and why is it important to flare during landing. What is flare? Flare in an aircraft is also referred as landing flare. This is a segment of the landing phase which occurs after the final approach and before touchdown. During a landing flare, the pitch attitude of the aircraft is gradually increased along with a reduction in engine power. To understand why flare is important, we need to first look at the segments of the landing phase. What are the segments of the landing phase? The landing phase can be divided into the final approach, flare, touchdown and rollout. During the final approach, the aircraft is stabilized for landing in proper configuration or flap setting with landing gear extended and at landing speed. During touchdown, the main landing gear makes contact with the ground. The contact must be firm enough to ensure positive rotation of the wheels to improve the brake efficiency. The flare ensures a smooth transition from final approach to the touchdown phase. Why is flare important? The landing flare will ensure that an aircraft lands on its main landing gear with a pitch up attitude which is how an aircraft is designed to land. An increase in the pitch also causes an increase in the drag, causing a reduction in the aircraft's speed, which is required during landing. During the flare, the thrust or engine power would be set at or below idle to reduce an aircraft's landing distance. When is flare initiated? Depending on the type of aircraft, the height at which a flare is initiated will vary. For some fighter aircraft, flare is not required and the landing gears should be strong enough to withstand the landing loads. For other aircraft, the flare may be initiated a few inches or a few feet above ground level. What if the flare is executed incorrectly? If the flare is executed incorrectly, there may be an impact on the touchdown and the rollout segments. If the pitch attitude is increased more than the desired angle, then there is a sudden loss of energy which will result in a hard landing. Improper flare may also result in delay in the touchdown of the main landing gear, which can cause an increase in the aircraft's landing distance. This scenario is called as runway float where the aircraft is flying above the runway and did not land in the touchdown zone. An incorrect flare may also result in a tail strike which could be because of low speeds and high pitch attitude. Actions to be taken in case of improper flare. If the flare is not executed correctly or if the aircraft is not in a stabilized condition, a go-around should be performed. Here, the pilots will increase thrust to the maximum power and another attempt is made to land the aircraft safely. So that's all for my video on the landing flare and why is it important to flare an aircraft during landing. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, do subscribe and you can continue watching some of my other videos as well.